landed on Corellia. The ledge is near. Roth, you are there to protect Darth Thauron from Maris's threats. Our efforts to locate his secret headquarters are ongoing. Another digit of the hand will tap the Roth. Meanwhile, we are tracking three assassins arriving on secret landing fields. It will be difficult to stop them all. The time for action is now. Transmitting the coordinates for all three landing strips. Received, my lord. These killers are but the first. There will be more. Varon actively defies Barris. If he dies, Barris will be named the voice of the Emperor. Protect Darth Vauron at all costs, and aid in his attempts to undermine our enemy. Goodbye. My lord, I'm detecting a forced transmission. I assume you still recognize me. Consider yourself fortunate that I am reaching out like this. My old master, you have some nerve showing your face. I believe you have the market on nerve cornered, my friend. I'm here to tell you that you are being deceived. The organization you work for is not the Emperor's hand. You're the deceiver, Barris. I don't blame you for doubting me, and I will not apologize for my actions. I am the voice of the Emperor, and there is a reason for all we do. In the end, what you think does not matter. So believe what you will, but your handlers have you in over your head, sticking your wet nose in Darth business. I've gotten under your skin, haven't I? Your lack of sight is almost laughable. Walk away now, and perhaps our previous animosities can be swept aside. The nerve. He's gonna forgive you. He can do what he wants. I'll never let go of my anger. No more talk. Barris's assassins must be stopped. The pleasure of your arrival was expected, my lord. Welcome to Corellia. I am Lord Ferris, here to make a request on behalf of my master. Darth Decimus of the Dark Council has taken interest in your actions and desires your assistance in the battle for Corellia. I don't help any Dark Council member who's a friend of Darth Barris. Barris is no friend. My master sought you for a reason. Our invasion of Corellia was executed to perfection. But the ensuing occupation has met... difficulties. Darth Decimus believes you can help. If you're interested, seek out his servant, Darth Charnas. He will set you on the path of conquering Corellia. Who is Darth Charnas? The Imperial Authority on Incorporation Island. For now, he is the closest you'll get to Darth Decimus. Darth Charnas's ship, the Tears of Taris is on Corellia now. A private shuttle outside the spaceport will take you there. Coronet City, the jewel of Corellia, home to the finest trading and ship manufacturing in Republic space. Soon this will all belong to the Empire, and the rest of the galaxy will follow. Where are my manners? I am Darth Charnas, agent of the Dark Council. My master, Darth Decimus, requested your assistance. He says only the most powerful Sith can help us win Corellia. What's the situation here? This planet was ripe for conquering. Darth Decimus plotted our assault and we moved in. The invasion was magnificent. Our occupation flawless. Imperial forces fill Corellia's high-speed rocket trams. We began to cover Coronet City. Then rebellion erupted. Unruly Corellians knocked out the rocket trams. Now our soldiers are stranded. Send your troops against the rebels. Don't give them an inch. Our men are barely equipped to hold the spaceport. We need you to go after the insurgents behind the attacks. The guilty party is Corellian Engineering Corporation, the oldest ship manufacturer in Republic history. CEC exploited our one weakness. They turned our iron cannons on all outgoing trams, freezing our invasion, trapping us on the doorstep of the Empire's greatest battle. Storm the company and shut them down. It's the only way we'll break their blockade. I agree completely. Unfortunately, CEC shielded against conventional attacks. There's only one way in. The Hullcracker. A 
compact bomb developed by Zerka Karelia's deviant scientist to punch holes through capital ships. It will get us inside CEC. Then we disable their iron cannons, resume rocket tram traffic, and conquer Corellia. Unfortunately, Zerkas joined the rebellion, and they refused to hand over their hullcracker. I've got other business. Still, stealing Zerkas' weapon is tempting. Consider it. You're trapped here as long as the rocket trams are down. The hullcracker's under constant guard. Destroyed Zerka's assault camps, and they'll abandon the weapon to reinforce their headquarters. Once you rout the camps, find our commander Jastel in Zerka territory, then we'll liberate that hull tracker. Identify yourself. I'm the one who's going to send you to the scrap pile. You have been classified as a threat to my mission and must be destroyed. Target locked. <laughs> A welcoming committee. <laughs> Some days you just can't land secretly on a planet, even on a secret landing strip. If you know what's good for you, you will get back in your ship and forget about your assignment. If you knew who sent me, you'd know that would not be good for me. I know who you are. You're the apprentice Darth Barris thought he had killed. Marvelous. I've studied you, followed your exploits across the galaxy, you're a personal hero of mine. Trying to distract me won't work. I'm completely serious. You're a bit of an obsession. The way you handled Lord Grathen on Dromund Kos was genius. Yes, I know his son's behind the mask now. You took out Noman Carr and Admiral Monk and the War Trust and countless Jedi. Good, good stuff. It's nice to be appreciated. It's an honor to meet you. So sad I have to kill you. I've imagined facing you. And given my knowledge, I have pretty good ideas on taking you down. Well, here. Let me show you. <laughs> I mark your position. The third of the three secret landing strips. Your third target arrived earlier than expected. I am Servant Eleven of the Hand. You were told to expect my call. I will hunt down the third assassin. Where is he? I tracked his landing. I lost visual surveillance. But my primary purpose is a success. I have located Darth Valron's secret headquarters. Uploading coordinates. He is operating within hostile territory. A massive tower in the heart of Incorporation Island. All Republic controlled. Amazing. The man is daring. I'll give him that. Yes. He orchestrates the war against the Republic right under their very noses. His operations must be disguised as Republic. But if I found him, Barris's missing assassin could too. Hold? Yes? I will convey it. Eleven out. Servant two has spoken to me. He says to be ready for suspicion. I can handle anything this fake Republic headquarters may have waiting for me. You are the Emperor's wrath. My mission is complete. I am recalled. 
the hand hopes you find Valron before the assassin strikes. Circus camps are destroyed. How do we get the Hullcracker? I'll connect you to Darth Charnas at once. My ship afforded a spectacular view of your work. Zaka's forces swarm like confused insects. They've regrouped to defend the Hive, leaving the Hullcracker storage facility vulnerable. Circa is ruled by fear. Soon their explosive will be ours. Captain Jastel's team is in place, ready to grab the Hullcracker. You'll lead a more direct attack. Your target is Bral Tavar. He's Zerka Corellius figurehead, the definition of corporate sleaze. Bral Tavar has the Hullcracker's detonation codes. Without them, the bomb's useless. Break into his executive offices, get the detonation codes, then call me. My men will already have the Hullcracker. Tell your men to be ready for the final assault, Commander. I'll deal with Bral Tavar at once. We'll have the Hullcracker by the time you have those codes. I assure you, gentlemen, Corellian Engineering Corp has nothing to fear. The C9X droid will serve you well. Just keep your Hullcracker out of Imperial hands. We hear they've already breached your walls. A mild annoyance. Even if the Empire grabs our weapon, it's useless without the proper codes. Tell CEC's board I have the situation under control. Give me the detonation codes or I'll crush your precious company. Hold strong, Brawl. Better to die free than live under the Empire's fist. Speak for yourself. Here, take the Homecracker's detonation codes. Just, please, don't hurt me. Circus finished, and CEC's next. Commander, Bral Tavar is dead. The detonation codes are secure. Good work. Thanks to your earlier assault, my men secured the Hullcracker and prepped it for the blast. In the meantime, Darth Charnas wants to speak with you aboard the Tears of Tyrus. He's ready to assault CEC. Here are the detonation codes. Bral Tavar was eager to hand them over. I'm sure he was. Thanks to you, the Zerka Corellia Hullcracker is ours. These codes will awaken its power. Commander Jastel briefed me on your handling of the Brawl Tavar situation. His untimely end certainly broke Zerka's resistance. I didn't even break a sweat. Don't get too confident. Zerka was insignificant next to Karelian Engineering Corporation. With the Hullcracker in our possession, we can finally shut down CEC and end their attacks on our rocket trams. But first we must deal with their army. Legions of battle droids defend the CEC fortress. Our explosives team can't get close enough to detonate the Hullcracker. CEC commands them somehow. Cut the droids off and they lose control. You're right. CEC uses signal towers to direct their army. It's their only weak point. Bringing down the signal towers will disrupt the droids. Our explosives team sneaks in, detonates the Hullcracker and blows the CEC doors wide open. CEC is about to lose contact with their army. Once you remove the signal towers, contact Commander Craig in CEC territory. He'll prepare you for our final assault. Sif, are you lost? You're in a Republic-aligned corporate headquarters. Stand down. We are on the same side. I, uh, don't know what you're talking about. The Consortium of Corporations has cameras in every corporate lobby, so we are being observed by the Empire's enemies as we speak. A Sith comes in here, he's gonna meet resistance, so, uh, we're gonna have to kill you. Stop pretending. You're getting on my nerves. Really sorry. Just can't do that. Sound the alarm!
So Paris's most deadly apprentice has finally found us. My master has been on to you from the beginning. I am no longer Darth Barriss's apprentice. Yes, yes, we've all heard about Barriss betraying you. No one's buying it. Vauran can smell Barriss's ploys a thousand light years away. He knows the rift between you and your master is a ruse, painstakingly orchestrated to get you close enough to strike. So, drop the act. You won't believe anything I say, will you? Say that your Barris is stooge, and I'll believe you. But either way, I have to kill you. Die, assassin! Never find out, scum. You defeated Lord Harish, but you can't overcome the three of us at once. Stop! Lord Ket, stand down! My lord, retreat into the shadows. We will stop this assassin. There could be ten of you, and you would fail. Leave us. I haven't come to kill you. Please, don't insult my intelligence. I applaud you. Convey my congratulations to your master for his superior gameplay. The kill is yours. I ask only that I not suffer the indignity of decapitation. I've been sent by the Emperor's hands to ensure your safety. Varus is not my master. My mission is to bring him down. Nothing more can be gained by maintaining the deception. Ah, if this is true... The game is renewed! Darth Vauron, Barriss says you gotta die. Barriss strikes! Assassin had me dead to rights. You did not hesitate to defend me. My friend, I am convinced. What's more, I believe, with my help, you can defeat Darth Barriss. I was hoping you'd say that. Then, uh, I have a little confession to make. It is true that I'm here to lead our important war effort, but there are other reasons I chose Corellia. Significant pillars of Barriss's power base are here, and together, we can tear them down. You clearly have great power, but the Emperor needs you alive. It won't take Barriss long to dispatch more assassins. You will relocate to my ship where my crew can protect you. Far be it from me to defy you. My protection here has taken a recent hit. But before I go, let me guide you. Most of the Dark Council knows Barriss is not the Emperor's true voice, but Barriss's two top agents force them to support his bid. One agent safeguards secrets that he uses as leverage. The other leads Jedi Masters in campaigns against Sith who defy him. Now, if they were to disappear... My old master will be left high and dry. Ah, exactly. His support on the Council will evaporate. Barriss's first undercover agent is posing as Colonel Senks of the Karelian Resistance. His stronghold is a labyrinth of secret passages. Unless you scramble his security codes before laying siege, he'll be able to flee through a dozen different escape tunnels. What about Barriss's other agent? Uh, my operative is uncovering the identity and location of his Jedi infiltrator. I expect results soon. For now, sinks. These pulse disruptors will kill all electronic code emissions, effectively locking Senks's secret passages. In truth, he's a fantastic resource. It will be a shame to lose an agent of his caliber. I'll compel him to denounce Barris and join you. 
An excellent solution, if it can be done. My apprentices and I will report to your ship now. The minute I can point you to the second of Barris's agents, I will. For now, Colonel Sex. My lord, I have Darth Vargorn here for you. My friend, I am in the hands of your crew now. <laughs> they are an interesting assortment. My people are capable, don't worry. I hope their talents are not required. If Sex doesn't hand over the files he safeguards once you've neutralized him, I advise destroying his database to eliminate it all. Uh, once done, contact me. But leave the compound first. It's Paris's facility and sure to be bugged. Until then. CEC signal towers are down. The droids aren't getting coordinated orders. Very good. With their security confused, we can take the Hullcracker right to CEC's doorstep. Everything is in place, Darth Jarnas. Finally. Once CEC falls, the rocket trams can spread our forces across Corellia. Then this planet will be ours. We must move quickly. Zerka's Hullcracker is already in the field. Are you ready to shove it down CEC's throat? CEC ensured its downfall the second they defied the Empire. I'll see them punished. Commander, have your explosive steam prime the Hullcracker. Once you're in, sack the board of directors and disable the ion cannons. When the rocket trams are back online, we'll ramp up our invasion. Those droids will be on our tails soon. Keep them off while we rig this Hullcracker. You break into my company, then you barge in here without an appointment. My droids will throw you out piece by piece. Then Darth Charnas will realize CEC can't be taken. The sooner you and Corellia recognize Imperial rule, the better. This is C9X, the perfect marriage of Zerka's lethality and CEC's inspired engineering. Even controls nearby droids with a custom signal emitter. Combat tests went through the roof. Costs a fortune, but that's the price of freedom. The dark side breaks one's chains. Nothing else. How inclusive of you. No wonder Corellia is so eager to welcome the Sith. Come on, C9X, show your stuff. <laughs> Business is war, gentlemen, and we've almost got the scum beat. Uh, Master Moss, we have company. You? That means C9X. You destroyed him? Impossible. I bet you'll come apart much easier than that tank of yours. You're not laying a finger on me. Droids, attack! Benton, he has the C9X signal emitter. Maybe we should do what he says. Aurelian Engineering Corp stands for something. This is our chance to do the same. Go ahead, turn our droids on us. If you enslave CEC, it won't be with our help. You heard him, droids. Open fire. at once. Beautiful work. The CEC director's death shook the rebellion. We'll ensure their new leadership is more sympathetic to our cause. My master wishes to express his gratitude. I am Darth Decimus, member of the Dark Council. 
architect of Corellia's invasion. Doth Beres his right to hate one so powerful? Such strength, it fills the air around you. Corellia is filled with wretched people, crude scheming animals, begging to be conquered. We can help them by winning this battle, but I require your help. Anything for a fellow Sith. Charity is for the weak and the lazy. The Empire is neither. You'll be well rewarded. Follow me and you'll swim in the spoils of war. But first, we destroy the Rebellion. We must decorate Corellia with their dead. Take a rocket tram to the ruins of Labor Valley. Help Major Tradic burn the Rebels out of hiding. Then we will speak again. Verifying identity complete. Please stand by for official communication from the Citadel. Ah, my lord, I appreciate your indulgence. I am Moff Jayak. I would like to request your assistance in an urgent operation. 87 hours ago, the 5th Naval Patrol Group was attacked. All hands were lost. 1,239 servicemen total. Has the Republic developed some kind of new weapon? A new ship class? No, this attack was not carried out by Republic forces. Our servicemen were slaughtered by their own droids. We found the corpses orbiting in perfect rings around the Duba. Aren't droids programmed to be loyal? How could they rebel like that? We believe they were compelled to do so by a third party. The attack on our ships was not an isolated incident. Droids elsewhere have disappeared or sabotaged our efforts. All of these incidents have been linked to a secret movement calling itself Directive 7. A cadre of rogue droids that plans to exterminate all life in the galaxy. Steel and circuits are no match for the power of the dark side. I hope you're right. Time is against us. The renegades are already beginning to put their genocidal plans into motion. We must act now. I am organizing a strike against Directive 7's headquarters to begin as soon as possible. I would like you to spearhead the operation. I would be honored to destroy this threat to our empire. I am currently headquartered on the Imperial fleet. Come to the coordinates provided and I will brief you more fully on the operation. I hope to see you soon. The connection has been closed. Thank you for your time. Welcome to the Blitz, my lord. Darth Decimus told me you'd be gracing us with your presence. What we've got here is a clean-up operation. Factories were moving massive amounts of supplies to rebels across Corellia. Bomber brigades came in. We rained fire on their heads, ripped the factories apart. We just need to beat down the rebels hiding out inside. Such decisiveness is exactly why the Empire will win Corellia. I'm honored to serve. Unfortunately, I've had to deal with some unsavory company in the process. We're getting intel from an inside source. Unfortunately, his dalliances with the local women make him perpetually late. Manners, Major Tradic. We all have our vices. I'm sorry we haven't met. I'm Darbin Sul, Corellia's top counselor, friend to the Empire. I hope the Major hasn't dirtied my reputation. I hear you're feeding us intel on the rebels. I have friends, no, acquaintances in the resistance. I pretend I'm sympathetic to their fight and they tell me things like who's supplying them. Certain factories were churning out military grade munitions, battle droids, you name it. All donated right to the resistance across the core worlds. That's why we bombed those factories into an inferno. Not quite the subtle approach I hoped for. The bombardment trapped the rebels in the burning wreckage. Now they're angry, desperate, and sitting on the largest weapons stockpile in the core. If the Rebels get those weapons functional, we may as well abandon Corellia. I'll crush the Rebels' horde. Those Corellians fight dirty. Whatever munitions they've got have downed every squad sent their way. You'll do better. Just wipe out their weaponry. If I know my people, they'll bow to the Empire once their hope is crushed. that code is right. Why aren't my escape passages opening? The answer just broke into your command center. Strong enough to demolish my forces and smart enough to take out my tech. When the alarm sounded, I knew there was trouble coming. Don't strike! I'm a secret Imperial agent working directly for Darth Barris. That's not news to me. 
You discover and keep secrets for Barris that he uses to gain power and control others. My work keeps rogue Imperial elements from destabilizing the Empire. But that's just part of what I do. I'm essential in the fight for Corellia. I steer Republic-aligned resistance forces into battles they can't win. Shut me down, and we lose this war. Cooperate, and you may survive this encounter. You collect secrets for Darth Barris. That must end. Give up the information you harbor for him. There's no future in denying Barris. That was your last mistake. No! <laughs> Quite here, my lord. Nothing suspicious and no further attempts on Darth Varun. Captain Quinn is an excellent officer. I'm in good hands here. Barriss' false Jedi is still at large. He leads Jedi against Sith who defy Darth Barriss' will. My operative, Shadow, is searching for him. Unfortunately, Shadow is pinned down by enemy artillery. He has our information but had to go radio silent to avoid capture. I'll get the information directly. Shadow was cut off on the other side of Axial Park, beyond Coronet Zoo. The park is a frontline battlefield where the heaviest fighting is taking place. We have a safe house in that sector. Shadow will be waiting there. I'll carve a path through the fighting and rendezvous with your man. If you're interested, there is also an opportunity to help the war. The bombings that blocked Shadow are hampering our ground forces in Axial Park. If you could destroy the enemy artillery banks along the way, it would be most helpful. Either way, Shadow will tell you all you need to confront Barriss' Jedi spy. We'll talk again when the deed is done. The Rebel weapons shipments are stopped permanently. The resistance is broken. Good show. See what a little elbow grease can do, Major? Can it, Darbin? Darth Decimus will want to hear this. Major, Counselor, and my good friend, what news on the Rebel supplies? Destroyed, my lord. The resistance in Labor Valley is defeated. That's not entirely accurate. Their weapons are in flames, but the Rebellion here is still kicking. I'm aware of their persistence, Counselor. Intelligence monitored the Rebels' retreat. They slithered into the tunnels beneath Coronet City, like the worms they are. What tunnels? There's a network of underground pipelines. Rumor says they stretch kilometers beneath Coronet City. All of it, Salonian territory. If those furry aliens are part of the Resistance, we'll blast them off Corellia. Patience, Major. The Salonians are fierce warriors. Those tunnels are their nest. Your men wouldn't survive five minutes. You don't know the half of it. I've seen holos of a gang that attacked the tunnels, clawed to pieces. Nothing gets under my skin. That's why you're the hotshot and I'm the public servant. The rebels are down there collaborating with the Salonians. They're following the orders of Myrtle, a vicious warrior, and the Salonian's den mother. Her tunnels are the rebels' lifeline, moving troops and supplies beneath Coronet City. Take Myrtle's lair, and we'll fracture the rebellion. The Salonian tunnels will soon belong to the Empire. Storm the Salonian Warren and deal with them. On Shirin, Imperial forces will cut off their escape. As for you, Darbin, I require your unique perspective elsewhere. Take the first rocket tram to Axial Park. Wait my orders. Right away, my lord. Corellia's Prime Minister-to-be is happy to serve. Domesticate the Salonians or kill them. May the dark side guide you. I've heard much of the Salonians' fearsome leader. What say Quixi, Upkimakti, Kedai Tunaskale, Tanik Saikatsi? I'll rest when Corellia serves the Empire. I'm 
Gulab und den Käse-Sub-Ex-Azahans. Corellia is under new management, Myrtle. Impressive work, my lord. These rebels were foolish to fight a Sith of your power. I am General Hesker, Imperial Guard. Darth Decimus sent us to assist. I expected troop backup, not someone of your rank. The Imperial Guard responds to the most vital missions. We flanked the den and caved in the tunnels behind us. The rebels' transportation network is crushed. As for the Solonians, Darth Decimus leaves their fate in your hands. As Salonians will make good servants, but revolt again, and you're finished. Finally, we can focus on our fight with the Republic. Corellia's once pristine Axial Park is now a war zone. The Republic's desperately fighting to regain control. Darth Decimus hopes you'll lead our offensive. We collapsed the tunnels leading out, so you must take a rocket tram to Axial Park. Meet me in our garrison. We'll crush them. You honor me again, my lord. Welcome to Axial Park. Our battle needs your presence and your lightsaber. This used to be the most beautiful parkland in all Republic space. Of course, our fights changed the landscape considerably. Darth Desmus will brief you on the specifics. Impressive work choking off the Salonians. This fight, however, will demand the full scope of your passion, strength, and power. The Republic is going all out to hold Axial Park. They know that control over Corellia hangs in the balance. The park's crawling with shock troops, battle droids, and special forces, all led by one very dangerous Jedi. We've never faced such a massive Republic deployment. The Republic's entire army is no match for the dark side. You won't have to rely on the Force alone, my lord. We have bomber squadrons, special ops, and walkers in the field. But this battle demands more. Corellia won't be ours while the Rebels still stand. We must crush their army here, break the Republic, and take Axial Park. Then we're primed to strike at the Rebellion's heart. General Hesker, tell your men to follow my command. We're going to crush the Republic army. Excellent. But you'll have more than Imperial forces nipping at your heels. You remember the corrupt Corellian counselor, Darwin Sal. Are these restraints really necessary? Darwin is now your prisoner. He will join your foray into Axial Park, and you will deliver him to the Republic. You hear that, Darwin? We're marching into battle. I hope you're ready. Just don't move too fast. These bindings are giving me blisters. As tempting as it is, don't kill him. We need Darwin to help us infiltrate the Republic. Take him into battle as your captive, then lose him. Darwin should remember the rest. Like my mother's face, I charm my way into the Republic. Once you win Axial Park, I help bring them down from the inside. Precisely. Unleash Darwin, conquer Axial Park, and you'll plant the seed for our final victory. Hold nothing back. Look at Darwin. The fresh face, cheerful spirit. Not damaged enough to be an Imperial prisoner. Hold still, Darwin. I wouldn't want to blind you. We... You can't be serious. Much better. When the Republic questions your loyalty, show them your bruises. You deliver this rodent, and I'll direct your strikes against the Republic army itself. Well, that was exhilarating. I've never fired one of these things before. Maybe I'll get some practice in on my way to the Republic. The Empire is your master. Don't forget that. No need to worry. The Republic's on its way out, and I don't ally with losers. Farewell. When this is over and I'm Prime Minister, I won't forget you. General, Darbin's armed and ready. Finally. Now to the battle at hand. Our gun batteries are under assault. Drive off the Republic forces. Once the guns are safe, I'll have additional intel and orders. Stop! 
identify yourself or die. You better think twice before threatening me again. What? Speak up! My ears are still ringing from artillery fire! Relax and rely on your eyes. Obviously, I am on your side. Yes. Yes, I see, of course. I'm sorry, my lord. The ringing in my ears has unnerved me. I have a lead on Darth Barriss's other spy. A team of Jedi have secretly landed on Corellia. I intercepted a transmission from one of them to Barriss, conveying readiness to lead the other Jedi into a death trap. They'll run into me first. Since I don't know which is Barriss' spy, I was going to recommend to Darth Vauron that all be killed. The Jedi are gearing up in a Republic staging bunker. Enemy special forces deploy there, so it'll be a high-risk invasion. Return to Vauron when you're able. I'll rest up and make my way back to base. When you're done, you can contact me from outside the bunker and I'll have Armageddon Battalion secure the area. I'll report back to Vauron now. More power to you, my lord. here, Sith. You are severely outnumbered. Darth Barriss's spy. Identify yourself, so you don't die with these Jedi. Are you suggesting that one of us is an Imperial? A pathetic trick. He's in over his head and makes a desperate play to destabilize us. Be reasonable, Sith. You can't take us all. Final warning, my fellow Sith. Step forward or die with these prattling nuisances. Hold, I must speak. I know this Sith. Gentlemen, this is Darth Barriss's former apprentice, who has survived his old master's best efforts to destroy him. You are becoming a legend among us, my friend. I am thankful you've given me a chance to save myself. Master Injai, you? All these years, right under your nose. I was to lead you to your deaths today. Instead, I'll watch my new friend destroy you. You're the one I'm here to destroy. <laughs> you are a barbarian. Steady, Master Jess. This set saved us from a suicide mission. Glad I could help. You are a great asset to us. Be well, friend. Shadow here. Dispatching Armageddon Battalion to secure the bunker you cleared. But there's been an attack on Darth Vauron and your crew. They said to patch you through when you called. Doing so now. Apologies, my lord. The attack was sudden. Unknown assailant, very powerful. On the run now. Taking Vauron to a safe house in the Imperial Legislature. He wants you to meet us there. Tell me the attacker has been killed. Way out of our league, my lord. Lucky we got out of there in one piece. Almost to the safe house. Signing off now.
We'll coordinate your final assault from there. Thank goodness it's you, my lord. It's madness. Artillery blasts, Republic troops everywhere. I thought we were finished. Control your fear, Lieutenant, or I'll control it for you. Understood, my lord. General Hesker, he awaits an audience with you. Good work out there. Dobbins met his rebel contact. Axial Park's covered with Republic casualties. But they're not retreating yet. The rebels are massing at the Sith War Memorial Garden. A pit honoring Jedi scum who fell to our first invasion 300 years ago. Naturally, that's where the Republic base lies. Guarded by battle droids, Jedi, and a battalion of their best shock troops. You name the weapon, they have aimed it our way. The rebels are following orders. Break their commander, and we'll crush their resistance. A wise strategy, my lord. We've been tracking such a man. Lieutenant, his profile? Yes, sir. Master Corin Tok, a Zabrak Jedi Knight, Republic war hero, and veteran of the sacking of Coruscant. One of the few survivors. Many Sith fell to his lightsaber that day. He earned himself a pretty little reputation. Survivors claimed he was invincible. Blaster bolts splashing off skin. Lightsabers failing in his presence. I say it's that special armor under his robes. Since then, Master Corin Tark has aged into a hardened warhorse. His myth has grown, and he stands between us and control of Axial Park. Corellia's future lies with the Empire. No Jedi will prevent that. We will attack at once. You'll have the full support of the Imperial military. Lieutenant, order your men to strike the Memorial Garden. Hit every monument. Erase all signs of the Republic's past victory. I need you to spearhead the attack. Storm the Republic base and bury the Jedi Master. We take Axial Park now. There you are. I was afraid I wouldn't reach you in time. The Republic didn't buy my story. They accused me of being an Imperial agent, so I tossed them something extra. I mentioned your assault on the Memorial Garden. The Republic ate it up. They took me in, then sent a strike team your way. You did what you had to do. I'll deal with it. I'll make it up to you once Axial Park falls. Just be careful in there. Uh, that's my cue to go. I'm sure you'll pull through just fine. You're responsible for the Empire's sudden victories. I'm surprised you'd have the courage to face me. You know I can't be killed. Blasters, grenades, even lightsabers. No effect. I've defended the Republic for decades without a scratch. Some even call me the Sith Butcher. Not to my taste, but accurate enough. We'll see how your stories hold up when my lightsaber's at your throat. Overconfident. Like Darth Malak, who the men and women here died to defeat. This garden honors champions of the Jedi Civil War. Heroes. Revan, Bastila Shan, and my ancestors. Zabrak, who fought to save the galaxy. I follow in their great tradition. When I strike you down, the Empire loses its only hope of taking Corellia. I will savor your destruction. forgotten what pain felt like. Surely I'm trophy enough for you today. The wounded here are barely clinging to life. Just go. Leave them in peace. 
I came here to win Axial Park, not torment the infirm. At least there's that. The medical droids will evacuate the patients. I can't protect them anymore. I've killed the unkillable Jedi. Axial Park belongs to the Empire. One absurd rumor of an invincible Jedi, safely put to rest. Your powers are only rivaled by the Dark Council itself. It's been an honor, my lord. I only wish all servants of the Emperor were so capable. Darth Decimus is personally overseeing our final battle on Corellia. He's requested an audience with you in person. A great honor. You'll find him in Capital Square, the heart of Corellia's power structure. Assist the Dark Lord and secure this planet for the Empire. Few have had the pleasure of my company. Fewer survived the experience. But you've earned my attention. Together we will end this rebellion and win Corellia for the Empire. The Rebels' grip on this planet is weakening. Their pathetic resistance won't survive the day. Indeed. And there is no one I'd rather have lead our battle. Thanks to you, Axial Park is ours and Darbin Sul is embedded with the Republic. All the pieces are falling into place. Now our only competitors for this planet are the Green Jedi, Corellia's sworn protectors. The rebellion will fester as long as their council stands. So run these Green Jedi out of office. Unfortunately, their enclave is impenetrable. That's why you aided Darbin Sol's escape in Axial Park. The Corellian counselor has weaseled his way inside the Green Jedi's enclave. Now he awaits my word. Darth Decimus, what a pleasant surprise. It's time, Counselor. If you wish to become Corellia's Prime Minister, prove your worth. Let us into the Enclave. About that, the Green Jedi kinda increased security. I, I can barely breathe in here. You need two access codes to get in. I lifted one from a Green Jedi Counselor. I had to hug the guy to get close. It was awkward. You said we need two access codes. How do we get the other one? If I try to grab another code, I'll blow my cover. I'm afraid you'll need to do some legwork. After you took Axial Park, the entire Green Jedi Council fell back into the Enclave, except Master Bedok. He's cracked, always prepping for Corellia's days of darkness. Now they've come, he refuses to abandon the Republic Foundation Museum. So the Jedi thinks he can save the Republic's precious historic trinkets. How valiant. Smart, too. Museum security's tighter than most military bases. Plus, the building's crawling with shock troops and green Jedi. So you should visit the museum, take a tour, see the exhibits, grab Master Bedok's access code. Lay low, Darbin. When I return, we're breaking into the green Jedi's compound. Word in the Enclave is Master Bedok's locked himself in the museum's vaults. Disable security and you can reach him. You've served us well, Darbin. Stick close to the Green Jedi. Await my orders. Master Bedok will be expecting you. Head to the Republic Foundation Museum. Secure his access code. Then report back. And cause some collateral damage. The more relics destroyed, the more Republic history we erase. Breaking spirits is important. Ah, you made it! <laughs> this is heating up, isn't it? Barris has taken off the sparring gloves. This assassin was the most lethal to date. Don't leave anything out. I want to know how it went down. The attack was sudden and vicious. There was no panic, no confusion. To a man, your people stared into the face of death and did not flinch. Captain Quinn must be commended. He took on the assailant with no mortal concern. I'm making up for a past indiscretion. My commitment to my lord is unassailable now. You have nothing to be ashamed of. It is forgotten. Regardless, I am yours, my lord. This is the spirit the Empire needs. You've successfully neutralized Barris's agents. The end game is upon us. We must both go on the offensive. Until the threat against you is over, we must be cautious. Waiting for another attack is suicide. The last move here on Corellia will take both of us. 
In a secret lair on this planet, Barris has bound and indentured an ancient Sith spirit. He feeds off this spirit's power, stealing all her visions of the future. Everything he has built has come from her insights. If this spirit is to blame for Barris's strength, it must be destroyed. Ah, uh, uh, no, my friend. She is as old as the Force. She is the dark side itself. We must free her, not kill her. Only you have the power to break into his lair. And only I know the ritual that unlocks the spirit's bonds. Deliver me to her, and we will strike the ultimate blow and cripple Barris from within. Then I am one step closer to finally confronting Barris. We achieve this, and I will walk you into the Dark Council Chamber myself. Lead the way, and please be sure that Assassin isn't waiting. I'll come when you signal.